I mean, do your moms do you like my mom does me when you're locked out of the house and you're disabled and you're having blackouts and amnesia and forget things? <laughs> I mean, I don't know what planet I'm on sometimes around her. <laughs> and she's the reason I think it. <laughs> Whatever I'm thinking, she's causing me to think. Right. See, I, I try to trust everybody, including your own mom first. <laughs> But when she seems to turn on you and wants a key to your house and you're wondering, well, why? <laughs> Is she maybe also making you have the issues you're having? You know, I, don't know. I don't know either. See, like I said, right? Until the wreck, right? I was normal. The doing okay, right? I was passing school. I passed my High school equivalency and all that, right? Mm hmm And, you know, dating modestly, right? Including Lisa Baker, but like I said, right? Something seems to be going on that I'm not aware of with her. Mm hmm And the one person who can get over me is, unfortunately, my own mom, right? And she knows that, right? But see, some people can't discern weird situations, like the car wreck, right? When you're pulling out and making a left-hand turn, you can't yield the right away to someone coming straight, right? Unless they swerve into your path, right? Someone don't get that. <laughs> Someone's worried I'm suing people too, right? Well, people are hitting me, <laughs> causing me accidents. They're not supposed to cause me, you know? And it's weird how it's happening, right? It's unusual, I know. It shouldn't happen. It shouldn't happen. You don't put someone with a bad ankle in a six-speed when they've driven only a five, for example, right? They might not be as up on it, right? But no one wants to understand that, right? Okay. <laughs> not even the judge... Herself, I know. Well, that me enter in my ankle as part of the evidence, right? Well, either take care of me or don't. And get rid of me, you <laughs> know, right? Right. So, see, whoever it is, they're on my ass worse than a stalker mom, right? <laughs> or, again... A control freak mom. Or, again, mommy dearest, you know... <laughs> Which is based on someone's real life story, right? <laughs> so, like I said, what can I do about it but stay outside all night? <laughs> she wants her son to stay outside all night. Like, she's punishing me, right? For being human. <laughs> For accidentally locking myself out the house, you know. Forgetting that the key's in the house, right? Like, that can't happen to anyone. And, uh, even without a mental illness. Especially with two head traumas or more, right? And counting where he's blacking out a lot. And, and keep telling the doctors I'm blacking out sometimes. Up to an hour at a time. And, uh, okay. <laughs> and they can't do nothing about it. <laughs> But note what I'm saying in their reports, I guess, right? You know, usually a psychiatrist is supposed to write down what you're telling them is going on. Mm hmm But you remember and don't remember, too, right? I started blacking out in 2017 anyway. Not immediately, but when Thomas moved in, but then she's blaming Thomas, too, right? See, like I said, right... You know, I don't know who's to blame, right? I try not to blame no one, right? I'm trying to figure it out, though, what's going on with her sometimes, right? Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde, right, comes to mind, right? 